Today is March 20th, 2020. Yesterday, spring started, so today is the first full day of spring. I think having having that as your uh, anchor for the year has been my thing ever s since the beginning, I guess, because today is my birthday. Today I'm 41. I don't know what... Um, I don't know what to make of that other than it's interesting how this past year from March 20 last year till today has completely flown by. Even though I record videos four, maybe five days a week and I'm documenting everything, at least I make a second of video every day for another video that I do all the time. Having that, it still flies by. I, I'm constantly working on documenting pieces of my life as they go by and things is and all of these things that I've documented over the past 12 months still you'd think maybe that would help slow down just a little bit but it just keeps flying time keeps moving and I've always been told that as you get older time goes by faster and that's completely true and you have to wonder has it always does it always go by that fast or is it because you get older does it go I'm not sure I think at least with to give credit to making videos at least I've been able to to try to step back as much as possible and look and see how I'm viewing things and how I view the world and how I think and just how I think in general too, I guess. I don't have uh, I don't have an agenda for anything that I do on the videos other than try to get from point A to point B and maybe do something that people want to watch. At least if it's something that entertains me, that's what really matters. But I don't know. I, I think a, a year, if you asked me when I was 10 how long a year was it would be an incredible amount of time now I think when I see something that's gonna happen in four months I think well that's not that far away in a year it's like well that's uh, I'll, I'll blink a few times and it'll be a year <laughs> it really does it really does happen and I I think the only thing that would make me a bit nervous is knowing that as you get older it gets faster and you know that your time is finite to begin with and boy you better have your ducks in a row as much as possible but life is just gonna happen the way life happens the majority of the time and you just have to be prepared and as much as you can be that's the thing that gets you scared because it's January and then it's March. Next thing you know, it's June. It's August. It's Halloween. It's Christmas, and you're back in January. I mean, it sounds sounds crazy, but even just day to day stuff or going to work, going to work really skews your view of time. Also, when you know you get up in the morning and you have to go do something every day and next thing you know it's the end of the day in your home and you just everything starts blending together at least with that's another thing with the YouTube videos I can at least say you know it's today I'm gonna to do this and I'm gonna have a camera in front of me and maybe that'll make something a little bit different but I don't know this past year just flew and that was and that's because I did more than I've ever done before we went to Japan in May that was two weeks and I knew that was and I knew it's two weeks can be a little bit of time but I knew it was gonna fly by and I'm glad I videoed majority of it because looking back I'm like oh, okay I remember that oh yeah I remember it. Oh, okay because I mean documenting is just doesn't necessarily slow it down but at least Puts, grabs the moment and puts it down somewhere where you can go back and objectively look at it even. But this past year has just flown. I think I think I, I hopefully learned a little bit. 
<laughs> because it just goes by so quickly. You just have to be on top of what you're doing. And, and even if you're on top of what you're doing, it's still going to just move through your fingers like sand. And I think that's the only thing you can really take away from it is know that it's going to go fast and pay attention to as much as you can and don't pay attention to stuff that's absolutely irrelevant to what you're doing. It's, it's a hard balance to reach and 41 years is not enough time, at least for me, to get that balance right. I, the first thing is to realize that you have to do that. And then the second thing is to try to regulate it. And then the third thing is try to keep that regulation. So I think I'm in step two now. Maybe in, maybe, maybe I'm lucky enough to have another 41 years and I'll be in the third step by then. Who, who knows? That's the big thing. The big takeaway from this is who knows, but uh, March 20th again, hopefully I'll be here for t March 20, 2021, but you never know. So you just have to take it every day, take every day. And that's that. I mean, uh, really, I mean, I, I thought maybe I'd have like, I don't know what I think I would have, but, uh, at least I'm, at least as you're, be as present as you can and be, just be in the moment as much as you can because the moments are all you have. You, you can look back at the past and you can think about the future, but you, all you have right now is you, the right now, you know, it sounds really odd. It sounds cliched, but I mean, that's really what it is.